Welcome to the Movement Center and welcome to the Office Series, an innovative idea where we've compiled a series of videos showing you how to self-manage and self-treat common office injuries that we see all in the comfort of your own office. Oh, and move like you mean it. Hey guys, welcome to episode one of the Office Series. Today we are reviewing how to sit. Most of us spend most of our days sitting, unfortunately, or fortunately for some, right? And we spend about 10 to 12 hours a day doing that. So we're gonna review exactly how to do that and the best way to do that if you are forced to sit all day. Now our next episode, episode two, is gonna be how to stand. So that one's gonna be a bit more of a step-by-step -step process to how to stand if you are thinking about switching or switching between a standing versus sitting desk. But for today, sit. So we're gonna come over here, we're gonna use this fancy chair. Now people ask us all the time, what is the, you can grab a seat there, what is the best seated seat, we, a chair we can use, right? And really, I like a hard wood chair, something firm. And the reason is, is because it's gonna force you to constantly change, constantly change position. It's also gonna force you not to really lean on the chair too much, because it's gonna probably hurt and make you move a little bit. Um, so I like people to kind of sit away from the back of the chair to start with. But if we're gonna look at our average office worker here, sitting at her desk, right? One thing that we notice is she scooted right back to the, to the back of the seat. She also shifted over here is leaned way back and kind of relaxed. What does that do? Shuts off her whole core. So she's kind of hanging out, doing what? Blech. Blech. She's blech. blehing, leaning back like this. Her feet are completely relaxed. She's also, as a lot of females do, wearing a high heel bit of a boot. Uh, we're just gonna put her feet in a, what we call plantar flexion, which essentially means pointed position. We're just gonna stiffen them up. That can lead to issues like plantar fascia issues, knee pain, hip pain, that we'll talk about later in the series. But for now, we're talking about just sitting. These are problems that, that we see. Other thing we commonly see is people's shoulders rounded forwards and sort of hanging out uh, in, in desk jockey or death position on laptops and things like that, as well as the neck shooting forwards. So we're going to kind of come up with a simple solution for this, and that's going to be the stand up. Right? Not all the time, don't worry. And so as we stand up, we're going to see her here standing. Now, what we're going to do is first thing is squeeze the butt as hard as we can. We'll go a bit more into standing position and stabilization in our next episode, in episode two. She's gonna activate her core a little bit to neutralize that, that, that curve, right? So she's kind of here. And the other thing I like people to do is take their shoulders like this and bring them out to the sides, like that. Perfect, which is gonna bring the shoulder blades together. Then what she's gonna do from this position is relax her arms, but keep her shoulders in that place. Now her shoulders are set and she's a bit more open in the front of the chest. So holding this position, she's gonna go ahead and sit down about in the middle of that chair. She sits back, perfect. So now she's ready to go and she's active. You can see her spine's nice and neutral. She's not overextended and really, really arched. She might come a little bit more down there. Perfect. And her feet are nice flat on the floor. The rule, easy, easy rule to remember for office ergonomics is 90, 90 degrees. You want your feet to be bent 90 degrees to the ground. She's a little bit over that right now. You want your knees to be bent 90 degrees, hips 90, wrists would be nice, gently supported at 90 degrees, and this, or elbows, I'm sorry, and the wrists would be flat and can I in control in a relaxed position so you don't develop carpal tunnel, which will also be an episode later on for us two guys. So that's an easy review of how to sit. Rule of 90, get yourself set and standing, squeeze your butt, get your pelvis in a good position, sit on back down, bring your shoulders out to stabilize your position. And last piece, but not least, is getting your neck centered over top of your shoulders. You don't wanna be that guy hanging out like this all the time, because um, that's just bad news bears. All right, any questions from you? Good. Great. Any questions about that, guys? Leave it below. We always like to see comments. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're going to be releasing about a 10 part series here on, uh, on office mechanics and office injuries. And of course, move like you mean it. Thanks a lot. Yeah.